ISC's Vimeo helping the company beat earnings estimates amid continued demand for video software during the pandemic. Vimeo, though, expected to spin off from the company later this month, pending shareholder approval. But IAC already working on its new round of growth companies, including Care.com and DotDash. Joining us in an exclusive interview this morning is Joey Levin. He's the CEO of IAC. Joey, it's great to see you this morning. Uh, congrats on what looked like a great quarter uh, and what uh, may be an interesting moment, an inflection point for the company, uh, given, given the spinoff of Vimeo and the cash that you're going to be sitting on. And so I want to spend a little bit of time thinking about how you're thinking about the future of the company and what you're going to do with that cash. Sure. That's, that's all we think about. It's another new beginning for us. You know, we've done this multiple times before where we spin off our biggest asset. We spun off Match in the summer. That was the majority of our revenue and profits. We're spinning off Vimeo now. Uh, hopefully that'll be done in two weeks with, with it, uh, shareholders approve. And, you know, we've done this. The Vimeo will be the 11th. So it's a, it's another new beginning. This time, though, we have more cash than we've got just under $3 billion, uh, and more earnings and kind of more tools to work with to to rebuild. But the cash is certainly one of the biggest questions in there. So, Joe, how should investors, though, think about the company now? Because you have this sort of unique mix of assets all in different spaces. Care.com's in one space. You know, you made an, a, an investment in MGM, which, which effectively is a, a bet both on Vegas and traveling and China and all sorts of things. Uh, and now you have this cash. And so how should they think from a multiple perspective or even a comp perspective what to do, you know, what to think? Uh, it's impossible. Uh, the only way to look at it, the only way we look at it, and I guess everyone will look at it as they want, but I, I think putting it all together in one pile with a multiple is, I think, a very hard way to do it. We look at it as a sum of the parts and, and we look at it in the pieces and manage the pieces. So we look at MGM very separately than we look at care.com. And, and the business is also, and this is a little uh, antithetical, we don't really believe in synergies. They don't really uh, necessarily have anything to do with each other. Uh, but but we see common threads and we see common learnings among them and, and shared intelligence among them. And that's, I think, what, what has led us to to do pretty well with the businesses that we have in the portfolio historically. So so the parlor game now is what you're going to do with all that cash. Can you give us some hints? What, what do you like? What are you I, I thinking about? I, 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 there, there's a lot of things we're looking at. I don't know the answer. I mean, in times like these in our past, there's, there was one period where we used a huge amount of the cash for uh, share repurchases, uh, and we bought back you know, over a period of years half the company. And there was a, a period like this where we bought bought uh, all new companies and and some companies that ended up being big growers in the the basis of a lot of our recent growth. I think both are on the table for us. Both would be could be great uses of cash. I, I generally, you know, we want to be involved in new businesses and things that are growing, and, and there's a lot of exciting things happening right now. Uh, I mean, companies are very rich right now. Multiples are very rich, but there's always opportunities. Uh, and and uh, just one example, care.com, something we bought pretty recently. In Just in that category, there's tremendous things uh, uh, happening in terms of senior care, in terms of child care, in terms of what's happening in, in the enterprise work, helping out with child care, in terms of ha what's happening with government, helping out with child care. And our first business was care.com. We just bought another small business there a few months ago. And uh, I think there's a lot more we can do there. And the same is true on the publishing side. We bought a lot of businesses in publishing. That's worked out well for us, bringing them onto a common platform. And I think that, that, that we could continue to buy there too. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.